for our art project, we are going to be making something that has to do with our theme this week, which is Summer Olympics. So in the original Olympics back in Greece, when someone would win an event, they would place on their head what's called a laurel wreath. So it'd be like a little leaf crown that they would put on their head to signify that they won. Today we're going to be making our own leaf crowns or leaf headbands from really simple objects. All you need is one strip of green construction paper, some tape or glue dots, and some leaves. Alright, so we need leaves. Do you guys see where I can find some? Maybe outside. Let's go! So we're outside and we're gonna go find some leaves. Now I have this big bush outside my apartment, but as you can see, the leaves are kind of small. We want something a little bit bigger to go around the crown of our headband. So let's keep looking. Hmm. Now something like this kind of leaf would be a little bit better because it's a little bigger. So I'm gonna go ahead and get about 10 to 15 leaves for our headband. leaves but here's a tip make sure there's no bugs on them before you bring them inside all right so I got my leaves and I hope I have enough if not I'll just go back outside and pick some more but I also have my construction paper and now I had to cut two because my head is not that small but I guess if you want to make a bracelet that's fine but anyways I got two pieces of green construction paper and what I'm gonna do is staple them together on one end like so I usually do one on the top and one on the bottom and then I can kind of measure my head actually my head is like probably that big <laughs> so I am just going to staple it and it's a little small and you're gonna do this obviously for your own head or whoever you're making this for. So obviously you're going to want to measure it to their head and then staple on the other side. So there is your headband, the base of your headband. And what you're going to do is, and you can do this a couple different ways. I have these little things called glue dots that are these little pre-made dots of glue that you can attach to your project and attach to the leaves and then it'll be easier and there's no drying time for this so that's really awesome or you can use tape to apply your leaf to your headband or you can keep using the stapler it's up to you how you want yours to look so I maybe will do a couple with the blue dots a couple with the stapler we'll just see how it goes so what you're gonna do is take your leaves and you're just going to apply them just like this and I like how it has a little bit of room above it to the entire band of your headband and when it's done you'll have your own Olympic laurel head wreath. Now for these kind of leaves I accidentally picked them with the stem on so you can just kind of use your fingernail and pop them off just like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. <music> some embellishments, maybe some glitter glue, whatever you want to do to make it fancy, that's up to you. All right, so here we have our laurel wreath crown. And as you see, I put my leaves up, but if you look up pictures of what laurel wreath crowns look like, the leaves actually go back away from the front of the face. So if you wanted to make two and you wanted to change the direction of the leaves, that is up to you. But I think this is fun and even if you didn't want to wear it as an Olympic crown, you can pretend you are king of the forest, queen of the forest, whatever you want to be. I think it's a really fun piece of dress up accessory. But my question for you is, if you 
were to compete in a summer Olympic sport, which one would you pick? All right, that's all I have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed making your leaf crowns and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.